So here's another tip for you guys who are stippler brush users. Try to avoid pouring your foundation into the brush because that is not good. You want to just mainly concentrate on putting the product right at the almost the very end tip of the white bristles, okay? It should not get into the black at all. The black should just help it, you know, kind of like just just to help it to give it body per se so that it stipples on nicely as far as that dense feeling the black goat hair should help with the body of the brush okay and it should not help with the application at all so if you're getting products right in the black right here then you're most likely using it incorrectly so what I usually do is I pour a little bit of the liquid foundation at the back of my hand all right but I'm used to using a mixing palette and for this demonstration I'm just going to show you guys using my petri dish and what you do is that you stipple the brush on top of the foundation just like that see how it's just on the tips of the white fiber that's what you want okay and your palette should look like this okay it almost have dots in it and get them even right into the tips of the bristles okay and like I said it should not touch the black at all see how it's concentrated right on the tips see the foundation right on the tips that's what you want okay you don't want the foundation to seep right into the black bristles okay so you once you got that even on the tip of your brush you stip, stipple it on and I've seen a lot of uh, people apply this on like a brush like a painting brush okay there's a reason why it's called a stippler because it's a stippling brush okay what you want to do is stipple it okay see how it's like dotting your skin it's like a pixelized pattern on your skin that's what you want that's the secret to the stippler brush is because it's giving you a pixelized look which is the same kind of like technology in airbrush makeup you know when it blows micronized dots into your skin that's exactly the same thing that you want to achieve with this stippler brush so you stipple it on okay and you just stipple it stipple it stipple it until you get the coverage you want okay see how the product is still concentrated on the tips you want to keep that constantly throughout the whole application process So the product should not reach the black hair at all. Look at that. It looks like my cheeks like airbrushed right there. Okay, so stipple, 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 stipple. Once you get used to this, really, it doesn't take that long. Once you have the hang of it, it takes like couple of minutes to like really do your whole phase and one thing too is like with a stippler brush you don't need as much products you don't I mean look at the product I, I still have that much I've only used this part right here so I still have that mound right there see the difference it's really cool look at that look at my acne scars like it's gone like it's definitely a lot softer so I'm going to powder to set